Howdy, I'm Cyberax with Outlandish Lightcraft, and today we're continuing our complaint series on Mojang and their inability to do meet their goals and, I don't know, do their jobs. Today we're going to talk about the visuals, the visuals in Bedrock and how bad they are. Look at our uh, entity render distance. I mean, it's just ridiculous. Um, the cloud system has to be a particle system, which then pops because for some reason, when you look directly at particles, they have problems versus if you like look off at an angle, then they're fine. Um, so for some reason the material system is so bad even though these aren't z fighting they're not on top of each other they're just layered they pop like crazy because this system is so broken so i don't want to talk about the water i know the water is dark but i do want to talk about the lighting system so let's uh change it back to set noon and uh you can see um just how bad the system is um i mean look at once again this is oh sorry let's do noon this is noon um look at the the lighting on the boat You can see just how bad the lighting is. Um, Mojang said over and over they want to do the super duper pack and they failed. They want to do RTX and they failed. They want to do deferred. Deferred was created on an employee's vacation. That's how incompetent Mojang is that they have to force staff to work on their vacations to come up with lighting systems to make things better. And then those lighting systems are still out years because no staff are responsible for them. It seems like it's just somebody's like vacation time or part-time job to get a new lighting system in. And you don't really realize how bad it is um, until you take this exact same asset and you, I don't know, put it in a real game engine and all of a sudden you say, wait, what? Why, <laughs> why, why is this so bad? Like, why is Mojang have such horrific lighting in their game versus just, I mean, look at the difference. And yeah, we're, the light, the the water is different, sure. But the water in Minecraft is already a universal joke. Everybody's already talked about that a lot. Um, look at the shadowing. Oh wait, we don't have shadows in Minecraft uh, because round shadows shadows are their style choice. What? Um, which everybody hates the round shadows it's the number one thing requested to re be removed uh when you start doing custom stuff you just you just look at the lighting in here on uh, this is the exact same ship i didn't change anything it's just a basic alpha material nothing special and look at just how beautiful the side looks. Look at how beautiful the wood shines. This not even have PBRs. There's no materials that even show. It's literally the same as Bedrock. The only difference is Unreal Engine cares about their lighting engine and has competent staff, and Mojang doesn't. If Mojang had confident st competent staff, Super Duper Pack would have released, and all of this would have been a null point but instead they failed and they failed and they failed and they're allowed to keep failing because the fanboys don't seem to care when they fail and just like ignore it it's crazy it's like their customers have amnesia um it's insane so here's another just critical failure point from mojang you see people posting all the time deferred uh, experimental content showing how amazing it is to have the new lighting system and how wonderful it is except it's years away 
uh, if that, if it ever gets released, if it's ever stable, um, especially with the PlayStation custom, you know, game coming out for PlayStation 5, like, is that really going to support defer to custom graphic engine versus, you know, them actually doing their jobs and hiring staff to put in a real uh, graphics system and a real lighting system? So I think just instantly render distance, um, lighting, shadows, just the way that the wood and the materials are just so beautiful. Remember, this is a cube ship. I made this in block bench. How does it look so much better in a different engine than the engine it was made for? Because Mojang is a complete failure. This team has failed at most turns. I the thing I was told recently is, oh, Mojang's doing so good. Look at their uh, they're putting they're bringing patch show pouches out. We're gonna get new storage. How many times has Mojang failed to bring new storage and pouches out? Like seven. I mean, just in the last five years, they've come out with tons of ideas and concepts and said, oh, we're going to do this and then failed at it. But all of a sudden, they say they're going to do another one. And everybody's like, oh, they're really going to do it this time. They really are going to do it. There's no evidence that they fail over and over by every other time they've said they're going to fix the storage issue, which is also like one of the top complaints from gamers for quality of life is the storage system is just a joke as well. So now you've got a joke of a storage system that they can't fix. They say it's fixing it soon. It just took them five to you know seven years to do. Um, you know the game was only took like two to three years to make the whole game, I believe, from the original studio J uh, J Four. Those people are competent. Those people are going to make an entirely new game that's a Minecraft clone before Mojang's team can even add lighting. That's how incompetent Mojang's team is. So this has been my uh, video on lighting and the incompetence of Mojang's team. Personally, I think they need to be fired and the original team needs to be put back in place. Let's jump back over to our oh-so-wonderful, um, you know. And you could say, I mean, even then, look at the render the render speed's just ridiculous. And this is on 90, but it should be able to do it. It's 2024. This is running on a 3090, and Bedrock's engine and their staff is so unable to optimize their game engine and to set it up for anything other than cubes. Um, then why make a live-action movie with polymeshes? Really? Like, how out of touch do you have to be if this is your style and this is your style guide and everything has to be, you know, 30 block render distance and shitty ass clouds and shitty stars and shitty su uh, sun and you can't have HD and you can't do any of this stuff and we can't have a lighting system and we can't have big trees, then why did you make a movie with all of that content that breaks everything that you bash us and show hate for the community weekly over? You enable the community to bash people because of this stuff by calling Polymesh's cursed, your own staff. Um, you allow this and enable it. It's sick. It's gross. The team at Mojang should be fired. So, again, I'm Cyberax with Outlandishly Crafted. And as you can see, I'm uh, moving back to Unreal Engine after all of the abuse and uh, harassment and issues uh, and failures for Mojang after five years. Um, I think a lot, you're going to see a lot more of the top talent and bedrock go somewhere else. Um, so, good luck.